Hey, this is Tom O'Dell, and this is my Behind the Album with Deezer. It's a strange, strange album, like, in a way, as much disrupted by my own mental health as it was by the pandemic. Like, wasn't really sure what I was going to write about. In the writing process, I was sort of struck down by these, basically these panic attacks that I was having, and they were getting worse and worse, and then I had to sort of stop the first time and yeah, you know, I listen to the album now it's like to, to me it's actually very painful at moments to listen to because I, I realised like how like hurting I was in a lot of ways I was in a lot of I was very lonely and I think when I was making it and you can hear that in the music in a way I think it was either Numb or Monster I can't remember it was one of those two Maybe I had, there's a song on the album called Tears That Never Dry. I think I might have had that actually before. I think I might have wrote that on tour actually, in some dressing room somewhere. I've been very touched by um, the messages I've got. It seems to me what I've learned, the sort of greatest medicine for mental health problems is to reach out to other people there's a degree of intimacy that I have with my fans that I don't even have with my friends. Like, people are, people are willing to be more honest than I'm sure they're honest with, you know, their parents or their best friends. I don't know, it's, like, strange. Like, And I feel, in response to that, I feel like I can be totally honest to, to my fans in, the, in a way that I'm not to other people. And I feel like there's this sort of secret, very sort of intimate relationship we have with each other um, that's not creepy or weird, um, that actually is like really inspiring and inspires me to keep going and inspires me to keep making music. Yeah, COVID, I think more than anything, it, you know, was very distracting because it felt like you know, an apocalypse was, was happening. And, but I think I was incredibly lucky to have something to get on with during like the lockdown and the pandemic and actually have something I could focus my energy on, whereas a lot of my friends didn't have that, and I really empathise with that. And, and, I, and, I, and, I, and if I hadn't have done, I think I would have gone mad. I, hold my hand. I think it's the entire thing's a happy accident. <laughs> like, I, it, like, in so many ways, like, I think music is, like, that word, is happy accident, is, like, so, so often, like, what you're looking for. I mean, in a way, like, songwriting, in a lot of ways, is that. Like, you just play and play and play until something crafts into something and it a lot of the time it is accident the best stuff is often an accident I, the best best thing i've ever heard is I, I think it was picasso said something like you know you can't choose when inspiration strikes but when it does strike it has to find you working and like ready you know in the studio i've gone on a real journey um musically recently and um, I was getting into a lot of like pop music and hip hop. Like, was listening to um, a lot of like Rosalia and Travis Scott and ASAP Rocky and the Kid Leroy and uh, but so much, you know. Like, I listen to so much music and I I love where pop music's at. I love where contemporary music's at. Previously, I've made albums that. I make them with two or three people, and, and sometimes even just myself. It's, 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 this is, I opened up much more on this one. Elton called me up the other day, and he said he had just pre-ordered it. So, he's, he's my, like, ultimate hero, so I'm excited about him hearing it. I'd like people to listen to it with open ears, because I actually think the thing I'm most proud of is that it's not that. It's not anything. It's not anything I've made before. I don't think it's like anything that's any, that anyone's made before. I think it's unique. And I think it's idiosyncratically mine. And as an artist, that's all I can try and do is just to be myself as much as possible and just be honest as I possibly can. And I think it does that. <laughs>